Thinking about what's happened to me from July Up till now Don't know where Don't know how Lately I've come to realize That I can't see it in your eyes So it's true I'm so glad you feel it too Nothing to hide Falling in love Late Tuesday night from vacation. I just feel like this week has just flown on by. And so all morning I was texting with some of my friends and we're planning to do a uh, go out New Year's Eve. We're gonna go to Pittsburgh and just enjoy a really cool night downtown Pittsburgh. So I need to find a dress to wear. Something fun, simple, not expensive. I just wanna, you know, find something just cute. So we're gonna head out and do that today. And then also um, where I get my hair cut, they have a Christmas tree with local foster children and I picked a name. So I'm going to go out and buy, uh, the girl that I chose, um, some gifts for Christmas and then I'm going to go drop it off at my salon so they have it to, to bring to wherever it needs to go to. And so I'm going to do that today as well, but also I wanted to share with you guys. Remember I talked about this palette that came in the FabFitFun? I used this entire thing today. I used it for eyeshadow, blush and highlight and I think it's so pretty. I love it. So that's what I have on today. And I have linked below the lip that I've been wearing this entire vlog. You guys all seem to be loving it. But this is what I use for, like I said, for my highlight, eyeshadow and blush. I love it. This came in today's, uh, it's a Butter London. It's a red nail polish. You guys know I do get my nails done at a salon. And actually this color is almost exactly like what I have on my nails. So I'm gonna give this bottle of polish to my mom. So I'm gonna drop that off to her today too. Um, you guys, oh my gosh, can you believe I went through all that work <laughs> to do the treat um, that we did yesterday, the toffee, and I was gonna take one to Allie and Jake, and I left it at home, so I will give it to them. I gotta finish um, boxing up or packaging up the other um, the other ones that I made, because uh, I made you know plenty of toffee for at least two more, and uh, Mike and Kim stopped over last night, and they tried it, and like, this is so good. I said, I know, it's delicious, and um, then we went to Allie and Jake's and saw all their Christmas decor and, and they, the lights outside. It just looked so pretty. And then we all went out and grabbed a bite to eat. It was just such a beautiful night. Um, and oh my gosh, too, by the way, you guys, we sold out of our prayer necklaces. So don't fear. We did order some more right away. Um, we still got some of the, we still have some earrings, which you guys, these are so gorgeous. I love these earrings. They're like a statement. I don't know something about them. I love them. Um, so anyway, I'm going to get my coat on, take Archie out and we're going to hit the stores and see what we can find. Again, I want to find something inexpensive. I might just go to TJ Maxx. We'll see. So see what we can find. Thought I'd share a real quick output of the day today. And here, I'll flip this around. So I've got on, hold on. I like when it gets lighter. Wait, hello. 
Okay, what's not gonna do it? Okay, so I got my Pikes Peak <laughs> sweatshirt on from vacation. Our new shacket, which I am loving. My leggings, these Zella leggings, I got at the Nordstrom anniversary sale. And you guys, they are so comfortable. And I love because they have a pocket. And then these new, again, Mark Fisher booties. So, all right, this is the outfit of the day. I'm gonna go run out and see if I can find a dress for New Year's Eve. I just booked the reservations for our hotel room. And what else? Oh, I have to get the gift. The Christmas lights fill the city. There are people everywhere. The snow oh my gosh, you guys, I've been so busy shopping. I forgot to get on here and check in. So I did find a dress at TJ Maxx. Um, Jody was at H&M and she found a really cute one for the same price. So I might go check that one out. And then if so, if I like it better, I'll return the one at TJ Maxx. The line was so long there. Um, let me see, what else? Just got done, went into Target and bought something for um, the one child that I picked the, uh, the tag for. So I had to get a gift bag, I forgot to buy one, and go take that to my salon. And then I went into Ulta and picked up some more Christmas presents. I had a 20% off, so I got to use that. Um, oh, did I tell you guys my my credit card got compromised yesterday? I was going Christmas shopping and I got a text message from my credit card saying, did you make this purchase? It was an online purchase. I'm like, absolutely not. I don't even shop at that place. And um, so they, of course, immediately shut down my card. They declined that purchase from whoever was fraudulently using my card. And um, they FedEx one overnight. And, and I got it already this morning, my new one. So I was in Ulta, and I thought I went online on my phone and um, went ahead and, you know, set up the card, activated it. And I guess I didn't do it right. So I'm checking out an Ulta, and it says decline. I'm like, are you kidding me? So I'm like, give me one second. I felt so bad. Um, the girl was like, don't worry about it. So thank gosh, you know, that you can call like the line and they were able to activate it like within 30 seconds. So it's working, my new card. I was able to finish and complete my purchases. So now I'm gonna head to H&M, look at that dress, and then go get a gift bag and then drop off the gift that I got for the little girl. I got her a journal, some Burt's Bees, she wanted some little um, lip balms, and I got her this purse backpack, and then I got her a gift card, so hopefully she'll like all her stuff. I really do. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead to H&M, and then we'll see where we go from there, but anyway, I just wanted to check in. I am home from running errands, and I wanted to show you guys what I got um, that little gift for the fostered little girl. And uh, I hope she likes it. So let me show you. Um, I really had fun picking this out. So she wanted some kind of a little backpack, like I said, a little purse. But I thought this was so cute. Um, I got her a gift card, because that's one thing she asked for, for Target. Got her some Burt's Bees. Um, these are like little lip balms. And she wanted to journal. So I got her a journal so that she could write and she can even circle like the day, the month. Um, so that's what I got her. So I have to get a gift bag and put all this in there and drop that off. Um, let me see what else that I got here. Oh, I got some really pretty um, wrapping paper from uh, TJ Maxx. And let me show you the dress I ended up picking out uh, for New Year's Eve. So here's the dress that I picked up for New Year's Eve. I love it because it's a little bit flowy. Um, you guys, it's so comfortable. It was $49, the same price of the one I bought at TJ Maxx and I'm gonna return. Uh, it's so comfortable and it's more lightweight. It's not itchy, it's perfect. And I love it. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I picked up some Christmas gifts here uh, for my daughter-in-law. She wanted, um, hopefully she doesn't watch these videos. <laughs> some Peter Thomas Roth um, masks. So I love these gift sets. Oh, I picked up Mark for Christmas. I know for sure he does not watch. This YSL cologne, and it's called El Intense. Oh my goodness, you guys. It smells so good. So good. So I got Mark that, and I grabbed, let me see, something else for Lindsay. Oh, she wanted an eye cream. 
so I got her um, also this First Aid Beauty eye cream. And of course some other gifts, but that's what I picked up at um, Ulta. And I think because I got a fragrance, hold on, I got some a candle set free from Ulta. And 20% off of all of this, which was great. And then I picked up, you guys know me, my lippies. I could because of 20% off, I did pick up another Stila. Uh, my one of my favorites. And this buxom, which I tried on this plump shot collagen infused lip serum oh my goodness it's all minty and i love it so i grabbed that too anyway okay so oh i gotta share something with you guys too so give me one minute all right you guys so this is something that i was watching the today show i think while we were on vacation anyway you guys know how much i love kathy lee gifford so i know i shared this book that she wrote was it last year or the year before? I can't even remember. I couldn't put the book down. I read the entire thing, like, I think in a night. <laughs> it was so good. And the book is called It's Never Too Late. Excellent book. And for those of you that are, you know, just trying to find your purpose and uh, just don't know where you're, you know, your bliss and, you know, what you're meant to be doing, you have to read this book. So fabulous. Fabulous. So anyway, she just came out with a new book and of course I had to get it and it just got here. And it's called The Jesus I Know. You guys, I cannot wait to dig into this book. I know any book that she's ever written, I think I own. <laughs> and I actually met her in person, oh my gosh, a long time ago. I went to see Regis and Kathy Lee a couple of times. She was so sweet. And anyway, I adore her. I always have. And I cannot wait, like I said, to get this book. So I just got here today. So whenever I have a down moment, because I'm so busy, I swear. And I'm actually a day behind on my Bring, it, bring On The Mary. So if you guys got this book that I talked about on my vlog a while back, this is a daily, this is the 25, um, days of great joy for christmas i am a day behind so i gotta catch up on this this is going to be my number one priority is to keep up with this so i want to be doing that as well and what else so i feel like i've been out and about so much today i haven't really chatted with you guys um again thank you guys so much i know you've been really enjoying vlogmas so far i I've been so busy trying to, yeah, I've been filming and editing and all that and just running errands and getting ready for the holidays that um, I haven't even had a chance to really sit down and watch any other Vlogmases. I watched Christopher Allen's Vlogmas 1 and 2. And so I've got a lot, I, I feel like I need one day of downtime to just watch Vlogmas videos because I love them so much too. I really do. So please list in the comment section your favorite Vlogmas channels that you love watching. I really would love to know. So if you guys can do that for me, that would be great. And please do me a favor. If you guys can maybe screenshot the thumbnail of the Vlogmas videos and put them out on your social media, your Instagram, your Facebook, and whatever, and say, please watch, share, like, subscribe. Uh, it would just mean so much to us, you guys. It really, really would. And you know what? The biggest thing is we want to bring as much joy and happiness as possible that we can during this holiday season. We want to be light in someone's day. I know you guys reach out to me so often I get emails and I get letters and DMs and just the kindest things that you guys say and how you know you originally found our channel through vlogmas and how it just gave a little um, light in your day a little hope a little inspiration and oh my gosh you guys it just means just so much to me and um, so I just want to continue that and um, I just think that's what the uh, the world needs, right? So, okay, well, I'm gonna go grab myself a big glass of water. Maybe I might even make a cozy cup of coffee. Put the fireplace on here in a second and catch up here on my Bring On The Merry book here. Now, we're probably gonna do something with friends tonight, so my biggest goal was to try to get this edited and as much as I wanna bring you guys along with me at night and stuff like that, but. I don't want to come home and be editing at midnight and uploading a video. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, um, I will link it. I'll put it right here and I'll share things like when I'm not vlogging on Instagram. If you guys want to just 
continue to follow what I'm doing, not that it's anything exciting. I don't even know what we've got going on tonight. Oh, and also remember, tomorrow is Saturday, and Mark and I are going to see Andrea Pacelli, and it, the concert starts not till eight o'clock at night. So I'm gonna try to end Saturday's vlog, miss. Oh, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do this, you guys. Saturday's, when I film tomorrow, when I vlog tomorrow, I don't know if it's going to be even possible to have anything interest enough, interesting enough all day Saturday to put it out sometime before we leave. Or do I... You guys let me know. Please, please, please fill the comment section. Let me know as soon as you can tonight when this comes out. Because I may... Do you want to see if I'm allowed to use my phone? If I'm allowed to like do a few snippets of the Andrea Pacelli concert if you want me to. Um, I can try to even... Some pictures or whatever. And then just upload... Saturday's vlog Sunday morning yeah so let me know if that's okay with you guys so that way I don't want to just do nothing Saturday which I know we've got some things going on but I'm gonna be returning that one dress and just little things like that um, I'd rather just give you something a little more exciting so if I can film all day tomorrow tomorrow night and then um, put it out Sunday morning that would I think be good if that's what you guys want let me know please 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 in the comment section okay I'm gonna go make a cup of coffee now, I think. Okay, <laughs> and then finish reading my book here. I don't think I shared with you guys that I added a few extra things as far as like decor wise. Um, since you guys saw my uh, Christmas decor video, uh, these cute little houses um, I got at Target. They are so cute. It came with the little, um, yeah, with the, here, with the little um, trees. So I think it was, a, these, let me see, one, two, this is my new Scentsy, oh gosh, this is the December, December warmer of the month. I think, isn't that gorgeous? I'm going to keep this, I can use this all winter. It's going to be so pretty. Of course, you guys, whoops, sorry, lighting has to adjust the deer. And then these other two houses also came in that set along again with the tree. So I really like how this looks. It's just, I don't know, like a little winter, winter wonderland, a little bit here. And I added just these lights, um... From Dollar General right here and I just think it's really pretty and it's cozy in here I really love the way this turned out so I forgot to share that with you I'm trying to think if I changed up some other things I did change I think let me see from the original video did I change oh yeah I did I added this warmer I don't think I had that for the original um, video and what else? I don't really know. I don't know. Oh, I gotta tuck these in. I gotta tuck these wires in. I like to tuck them in and get them out of the way so it doesn't look. I don't like the wires. I don't know how this came out somehow. There we go. Looks a little whoopsie. Oopsie. Let me fix that. Get that in there a little bit. Oh, well, whatever. I'll fix that. Um. I don't know what else, you guys. I like to change things up a lot. Look, I still got my Fat Fit Fun stuff I had to put away. This is my gift, a Secret Santa gift for a family. Um, anyway, I think I showed you guys this yesterday, how pretty this looked. Did I? I can't remember. Yeah, I think I did. Anyway, other than that, I think nothing's really has changed. Um, the only addition, of course, we added to the tree that I shared with you guys in Vlogmas day one was my Broadmoor ornament. And Giada made this ornament, you guys. Isn't that cute? My little Giada. Oh, my God. I forgot to tell you guys. I'm going to be taking you with me. Mark and I and Morgan and Tony and Capri and Giada, we're going to Secret, um, Secret Santa breakfast at the Lake Club on Sunday. And I'm gonna obviously bring the camera. I'm so excited now. We took Giada two years ago. Um, and then of course last year was the whole pandemic, you know, which is obviously still going on, but he didn't have it then. So this year, um, Mal Capri will be there. So I'm so excited about that. It's gonna be so fun. So I'll be vlogging um, that as well on Sunday. Um, what else? I don't even know. Anyway, okay guys, so it's, 
almost 4 30 so i think what i'm going to do is i want to go ahead and just i think i already have about 17 minutes of this vlog i'm going to go ahead and just wrap this up um and that way i can get this all edited and i can have it scheduled to go out to you guys tonight uh, so don't forget a few things oh by the way you guys your vlogmas sweatshirts those of you that do have them, I have not received any emails of pictures of you guys, so I want to put them um, at the end of these videos. So if you do have them, don't be camera shy. Email me your picture. Also, let me know um, if you guys are okay with me putting tomorrow's vlog. Um, have it come out Sunday morning. You probably will end up getting two vlogs on Sunday then, Sunday morning and then Sunday night. And um, is that else? what else I just wanted to say? Oh, and then share, share, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And again, thank you guys so much for taking time out of your busy schedules to watch my Vlogmas videos. It means the world to me. So uh, I hope you guys have an amazing Friday evening. And I will see you in the morning. Good night.